I'm a fanboy. I'm a nerd. I'm a, I'm a movie geek. My dad took me to see Star Wars 13 times in the movie theaters in 1977. This is the dream to be at your theater in a huge movie where the awards ceremony possibilities with Sandra Bullock and George Clooney. Yeah, no, I'm in heaven. I play Hugo Barco. He's the campaign manager for Senator Castillo. I'm losing. That's the guy trying to be president. So I call Sandra Bullock, Jane Bodine's character and her team to come and help us. And I'm very grateful for their uh, madcap, wild and woolly ways that they do, but I'm also a little jealous. So I tend to get in her way. I actually was like 40 pounds heavier. I gained weight for the film. Okay. They had me to be this big, massive kind of get in her way and just be grumpy. And she always has to kind of go around me to get her stuff done. I also I love documentaries. So um, this film's based on a documentary, Our Brand is Crisis. And uh, Carville, James Carville, was actually the guy in the film that went down with his team. Carville also elected Clinton, so I watched The War Room. That was another documentary. And then. Um, I did. I watched all of the Ides of March, which was also Clooney's movie, and uh, and then I looked at some of the Bolivian politicians. My uncle's the biggest Elvis impersonator in Bolivia, so I actually modeled my character after my Bolivian uncle. I did. You know, Bolivia means so much to me, and that's the fact that the movie takes place there in that country. My father was a big Latin trumpet star there. He passed away 20 years ago. My uncle is, like I said, the biggest Elvis impersonator. I'm a spiritual dude, and it's got Machu Picchu, and Titicaca, and indigenous plant medicines, and the Amazon, so yeah, it's, to represent the culture and heritage in my father's country, it's amazing. My little last part before this was, I think, one line on Hot in Cleveland with Valerie Bertinelli. Great, great show, great, but I mean, and now I'm starring in a movie with Sandra Bullock.